Last week, the spectacular Rainwood Pine Valley Golf Club in Beijing hosted Asia's richest LPGA Tour event, the Rainwood LPGA Classic. All the biggest names in the women's game were there, including the reigning Rolex Player of the Year in B Park. It's been another excellent season for the Korean star, who added a fifth major championship trophy to her mantle at the Wegmans LPGA. Golfing World sat down with Inbi in China to talk about her season and about that Wegmans win. Yeah, I mean, it's you know, always you know, very nice to win a major championship and to be able to do it twice in a row is the you know, first time in my career and I've never defended my title before, so I won twice this year, including a major. So, um, yeah, that Wegmans championship win was huge for me. The current number two on the Rolex rankings left her run pretty late. Standing on the 17th tee on Sunday, Inby was two shots behind Brittany Lincecum and needed something special to have any chance of winning a big birdie on the second to last hole was crucial. I think it's most important when you are, you're nervous and when that putt needed to drop and you know when it drops it kind of really gives you confidence and I mean I wasn't that confident with the putter that that day because I wasn't holding anything but number 17 putt gave me a lot of confidence. That confidence served her well as she stood over another big putt on the 18th. Having gone to extra holes the week before in Michigan, Inby needed this for a playoff after Lincecum had made bogey at the 72nd hole. Just been in the playoffs just week before that week um, with Mirin. Um, so doing it for two weeks in a row, you know, kind of you know gave me a little bit of a comfortable position, and um, the chip was just you know really good. I mean, I think 18th hole, you know, it's just really tough to make a birdie, so I just try to make you know a good par, and yeah, that's what I did. Inby's victory at the Wegmans came in the middle of a seriously purple patch for the Koreans on the LPGA. The country, which boasts no fewer than 23 players inside the top 50 of the Rolex rankings, has claimed seven of the eight tournaments stayed since the start of August. Mind you, 2014 didn't start so well for them as Korea went winless for the first 13 tournaments of the year. Everybody, you know, just got off to a little bit late start and. Uh, when nobody was winning, everybody, you know, wanted to win and obviously everybody asking why Korean players not winning and we're like, yeah, we don't know, but we're playing good, we're just not winning. Once one player started doing it and they probably got confidence from there and a motivation from there and, you know, we just started to winning from there and on. Perhaps the most impressive of those Korean victories came from Hugh Joo Kim at the Evian Championship. The 19-year-old went shot for shot with Australian legend Kari Webb in the final round of the season's final major and produced a spectacular birdie at the 72nd hole to win her first major title. I think, yeah, there is a lot of talent in Korean tour and obviously, you know, competing in that tour and all year long, you know, helps them to get prepared for the LPGA tour. And yeah, there is a lot of young, talented players out there. So um, especially Hyojo Kim, I think she could be the next, you know, next top player on the LPGA tour. With Inby currently leading the wave of Korean domination, she's been able to adjust to life on the LPGA alongside the players she grew up competing with. As a result, there was a great chemistry at this year's International Crown when NB teamed up with her best friends, So Yun Ru and Na Yun Choi. It was actually you know, one of the highlights of my career as well. I mean, it's, um, it was something different to what I've you know, experienced. I usually play for myself, but you know, I was playing for my country, for friends and you know, for the people. So Na Yun and So Yun were really close friends and sometimes we you know, share, you know, what you're going to do on number 14, you know, I, I think layup is better. And we kind of you know, share you know, what we think around the golf course and you know, when somebody's struggling with the putter, we kind of you know, try to give advice. You know, I mean, we're a competitor, but we're also friends. So Yon and Nayon will both be involved in Inby's biggest off-course moment of 2014. She's getting married this weekend, and the pair will be bridesmaids at the ceremony. The wedding is taking place at a golf course and is being squeezed in around the week of the LPGA Tours event in Korea. Yeah, it's getting really close, and I feel like I feel a little bit more realistic now. And my friends decided to take a role in my wedding, so you know, I'm really thankful, you know, that they are taking a part. So I think it's gonna be good. I mean, I'm the first one getting married in the, in in the pack, so I think you know I'll be their bridesmaid when they're getting married. So um, I think it's gonna be a lot of fun.
The nuptials are the finish of what's been a pretty amazing couple of years for NB. In 2013, she became the first Korean to be named Player of the Year after winning three consecutive major championships. It's been an incredible ride, and NB admits the less hectic pace of 2014 suits her just fine. If I knew that was going to happen, um, I probably wasn't able to do it because you know, it's something that I probably won't achieve probably the rest of my life. And I feel a lot more relaxed now. I, don't, I know how to you know, handle the media. I know how to handle myself when, I, when I'm in a pressure condition. So um, this year, you know, I'm probably second in everything, in every stats or every awards or you know, number two in the world. Everything, I mean, number two, you know, sounds worse than number one but you know in my mind I feel a lot more relaxed and I don't have I don't have to be chased by somebody um, I don't have any pressure you know if I um, play well in these last few events and you know you know become number one that's great but if not I just have a chance you know I have opportunity every week so um, yeah I just feel less pressure I'm happy